I lost him in the tunnels, but the swamp has him now. Varadrim, we were about to finish without you. He's still alive? Where is he? At the end of his bloody trail. This way. Thaisa. I need to speak with him. Then do so, Horadrim. Zorath! <coughs> oh, Elias. Was all this worth it, then? Truly? I brought Lilith to Sanctuary. A thing no one thought possible. And when Hell rises to sweep across this world, I should be there beside her, ready to push it back. You left me alone to cross the lines you would dare not attempt. And you have nothing to show for it. You are nothing but a wasted life. Do not look to forgive me, old man, because it is you who brought us here. Was it worth it? That is a coward's question, Lorath. It suits you. Elias of Aronok. Oh, spare me. Of your own free will, you swore an oath to the Tree of Whispers. This is not the life I deserve. <laughs> The tree does not forget oaths, and it does not forgive debts. It is time to let go. Laughter on the wind. Elias' head hangs from the tree of whispers, and your soul stone is attuned. This is where I leave you. Leaving? We go to face Lilith. I had hoped you would join us. I know the weight of your reasons, but Lilith remains your concern. Mine lies elsewhere. This is farewell, then. And uh, thank you for the tea. Take care of yourself, Donan. She called me by my name. Lorath won't believe. Where is he? I have not seen him since... since Elias spent his last words calling him a coward. And to prove his courage, he what? Rode to face Lilith alone? Elias never told us where to find her. But his head is on the Tree of Whispers. So the tree knows where Lilith is going. Lorath could ask, but he'll have to pay the price. What price? The same Elias paid. Eternity on the tree. Brother, no. Get to the tree now! Stop him! <laughs> 